kiss for you. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development. And so, guys, this will be the part four of my video series on professional sound recorder using Android Studio. Alright guys so in our previous video uh, we have done the uh, designing of our main activity in the XML alright and now in this video we will start working on our main activity dot Java alright so first of all let's we as you know that we have uh, the toolbar tab strip I mean the page sliding tab strip then we have a view pager and also we have a frame layout which is the container so first of all let's initialize the pager sliding so we can say pager sliding tab strip and we can say it as tabs and also we need to initialize our view pager and let's initialize them alright and then in our own create method we first of all need to initialize our view pager let's check if the id is the pager yes we have this and uh, the id as pager so after that uh, we also need to initialize our tabs uh, tab strip so we can say pages sliding tab strip and then we have find view by id r dot id dot tab strip all right after we have in the, uh, since we have initialized so now we need to set the view pages so for that we can say view pager dot set adapter okay so here we need to create our own custom adapter okay so let's say we have my adapter all right and then inside that we need to send the get spot fragment manager alright and since it is saying that so we need to create the class okay so let's try to create class here so here we can say class uh, public class my adapter and which needs to extend with fragment pager adapter and inside that now uh, we need to uh, implement some abstract uh, method so first one is get item okay the next one is get count and after that the next one okay so here they, it is saying that we should have a default constructor so here let's click on generate and constructor and there we have here you go so now here this you can see there is the default constructor so first of all we need two tabs okay first one will be of uh, record and the second one will be of saved recordings okay so let's try to have a string array and inside uh, let's name it as titles equals to and let's first of all we first one is record and the second one is saved recordings all right and since we have this default uh, constructor so now let's go down to our uh, get item okay sorry here so in our get item so we need a switch statement and inside that we say position okay so for case 0 I mean the position value is 0 so we need to return 
record fragment okay so we need to create that later dot new instance and inside that we need to pass the position all right similarly we have case one and it will return the file viewer fragment dot new instance and inside that we can uh, pass the uh, position okay so after that we have the get count method and inside that we can pass let's say two okay so here we can say titles dot length okay and also we need another method which is get page title and inside that we just need to return title array and inside that we pass the index as position all right and also we let's create public main activity all right so here now now that we have the main activity ready but we just need the the record fragment and the file weaver fragment so the so guys in my next video we will uh, we will start working on our fragments and we will first of all create the fragment and then we will write the code for the functioning of these uh, fragment okay guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe goodbye